I'm going to show you how you can change uh, the color of one element with the color of another element. For example, if we change color in one element, then the color of the other element in another view should be changed automatically. So let's get started. So first of all, if you want to change color of this this text here, I have an example set for you. So I'm going to change color of this text here and it will automatically get changed in the back back view here uh, basically these two texts are different and they are in different views this front and back okay so let's get started so first of all we have to came here in fence we know our product builder here we, here we are you just click on product builder Once you insert the insert your product builder, just click on uh, products. Here is my here is my product setup just for the sake of demonstration purpose. I'm gonna click over here. I'm just here's front and back, all set up. So this is the basic demo you can import from here right here. Okay, let's get let's edit this one this front one in product builder okay just click on it here we go there are different elements in this builder here so we just need to change this the color of this text type your logo this text we just want to change color of this text so what we're gonna do is just click on it so it will automatically get selected just uh, scroll down and open this colors tab here once it's open just add colors if you like just go on color pick it in google and select the colors this black for example we'll add some right here okay we have added four colors for this text so if you want to link this text from one view to another view just just type just color link group just use this option and name it like a logo okay copy this up and save this view okay uh, for now, we'll switch the switch the view. We'll change the view from front to back. Okay, here you go. Now all the elements of the back view has been loaded. For now, uh, we will target the element for which we wanna change the color with the front front end. Okay. Here we go. We just want to change this text with that text in front view. Okay, here you go. I've I've written type your black back logo. Okay. Uh, as you as you see, as you can see that in the colors tab, nothing has been selected over here. So if you wanna, if I wanna change this from the front view. Let's suppose I'll change the color in front view and it will automatically get changed in the back end. So let's link this link this up with the front one logo. Just type just type here the same text that you have given this in the front end. Okay. So that both elements colors would be linked together. Okay. Got it. Got it, man. Just click on save this view. So you have saved the pack view as well. So now just view this product here. You have to add this uh, fancy product designer product with WooCommerce product as well. So in front end, you can see this type your 
type your logo text here this is in the front view okay I'm just going to, I'm going to change color of this I selected this green one okay for now when we switch the view when 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 we switch the view then the color of that text that we have written in the back of that card can be changed automatically there you go this is a different view this is a back view okay but the text has the, the color of that text has been changed automatically you can do this with the background as well so in order to change the same color for the that background just click on that background one and you can you can you can use any element that you like just click on that and just put the link here the, the text of that link here save the view just refresh the page now the background of the second view which we have called the back view will also get changed with that text so let's give it a try I'll change it to blue one okay for now the back view the background of the back view should be changed oops that's perfect uh, okay guys I got I got this check here uh, I hope you have learned something new in this tutorial thanks for watching bye for now